In a speech at the White House, U.S. President Joe Biden called the new COVID-19 Omicron variant a cause for concern, not a cause for panic. This variant is a cause for concern, not a cause for panic. Biden added that the U.S. would face the new threat just as it has faced those that have come before it, urging everyone to get vaccinated and get their booster shots, saying it is the best protection against this new variant as well as any other variants. Gives us time to take more actions, to move quicker, to make sure people understand you have to get your vaccine, you have to get the shot, you have to get the, get the booster if you're, the sooner or later we're gonna see cases of this new variant here in the United States. We'll have to face this new threat just so we face those that come before it. Asked about the decision to ban travels into the U.S. from South Africa and seven other African nations on Monday, Biden answered saying it was a step forward that gives the U.S. more time to respond to the new variant. I, 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 I don't think so. I don't think that's the, what's going to happen. And uh, I want to, again, the reason for the immediate travel ban is there were a significant number of cases, unlike any other country, well, there are few around South Africa in the world. We needed time to give people an opportunity to say, get that vaccination now before it heads. It's going to move around the world. Omicron raised concern between world leaders and people fear new lockdown measures will be imposed. However, restrictions are back amid the detection of Omicron in several cities around the world. It will require anyone who enters the UK to take a PCR test by the end of the second day after their arrival and to self-isolate until they have a negative result. The Omicron variant was the quickest to be labeled a variant of concern by the World Health Organization because of its seemingly fast spread in South Africa and its many troubling mutations.